Hi there, and thanks for joining us here at Philly Capital Market Watch. I'm James Ui, Investment Solutions Manager from Unitrust Marketing. Today, we will be talking about investing in Asia Equity Unitrust. Asian equity market recently tumbled due to rising yields. However, we remain optimistic in the Asian equity markets. In the long run, due to the rise of middle class, strong economic growth in China, and attractive valuations. In 2020, there were 2 billion in the middle class in Asia, representing 54% of the global middle class. By 2030, Asia middle class will increase to 3.5 billion and represent 65% share of the global middle class. This phenomenon is going to transform Asia into a consumption powerhouse and the middle class would be the engine of future economic growth in Asia. With the reopening of global economies, it will continue to improve economic growth and corporate earnings. Recently, OECD has published the world GDP growth forecast. Asian countries such as China are projected to see positive and sustainable GDP growth in 2021 and 2022. China's economic growth is important because China typically contributes to 40 to 50% weightage of an Asian fund. Despite the recent corrections, MSCI Asia as Japan still offer attractive valuations. The PE chart suggests that the current PE ratio of 22 times is relatively inexpensive as compared with the other countries such as US and Europe equity markets. However, Asia equity may face downside risk due to potential renewed lockdowns from potential new wave of COVID-19 infections. Potential re-escalation in US-China trade war may also cause disruption to the equity markets. Despite the risk, Asia equity unit trusts are well positioned to capture the structural growth of Asia's economies. We also trust that active fund managers are able to capture opportunities in the undervalued and high quality Asia companies. Currently, we offer more than 400 Asia equity unit trusts on the Poyance platform for investors who are seeking to capture investment opportunities in Asia equity markets. And these are some of the top selling Asia unit trusts in March 2021 on Poyums. That's all for Philip Capital's Market Watch. Do remember to like and follow us on social media and subscribe to us on YouTube. Also, tell us what you think. Do you see the recent sell off in Asian equity market as a good long term investment opportunity? Leave your comments. Thanks for joining us and see you soon.